Hello, welcome back to another lecture. We're going to go ahead and uh, uh, create a sheet uh, set in this lecture. We have already done this on uh, this alignment, uh, so we're going to go ahead and try to make a, put a sheet set on this alignment. So go ahead and uh, uh, from your uh, ribbon, go to uh, Output tab. Right here, click on Output tab. And then all the way to the far left, uh, click on Create View Frame. See, we need to do this so we can put all the information that we want on our sheets. And in, in here, in this first uh, section, we're going to create the uh, uh, select the alignment. And once the alignment is selected, and it asks you what station, you want all the alignment, all the station from zero to the end, or you can have a user specified. So click Next. Next, we're going to go ahead and do the uh, setting for the sheet set. So what type of uh, uh, sheet uh, that you want? Do you want it a plan and profile in one sheet, or plans only, or profile only? Here, we're just going to go ahead with plans and profile. And uh, then we're going to choose the template. Down here, let's click Edit. From here, we're going to click Edit one more time to uh, select the template. And we'll have... Uh, you bring it back in here we have this uh, um, uh, window opens up and you see the uh, different uh, uh, selection you have a uh, sheet sets we have uh, plan production so I'm going to go ahead and just click plan production double click that and then I will choose from one of these lists not matrix but imperial for our plans we're going to use uh, uh, plans and profile so click that and open that up and let's go with the 20 scales. You can go with uh, RHD or R20 or RHD or 40. So 20 is good for now. So now that's selected, and then we want to call, let's like know the pattern of the uh, uh, alignment. Uh, along alignment, I prefer, or you can do a rotate to the north. And set the first view frame before the start of the alignment. You, If you want some working space, so you have some space, you can go ahead and do that. So you can make this to a first uh, 50 feet so you got some room in there it will not start right away so click next then you have the name well name is all set from the view frame name and these are uh pretty good we're going to stay with the uh, what uh, with the basic and uh, uh label location top left is good or you can switch it the way you like it uh top left so click next and then we're going to come into uh, a match line and this is very really important how you want your sheet to be matched and uh, i'd rather have it on a station 50 so when you go to the next page you are on a station you don't have to come back and try to match it and it's right on a station line and so and it says allow additional distance for a uh, repositioning increased overview so we're going to make this to 100 feet and then you're going to come in here and you have the match line layer and it has its own uh, style and uh, next uh, then you have a match line layer name that's good style that's good what we have here oops hold on that's the problem having multiple screen you have to find out where they are so match line uh, in uh, in Ross in uh, Ross station you can select a uh, match line station value next counter view frame group alignment name or view uh, frame group name. So then you're gonna go ahead click OK. You can pick one of those style. Don't be afraid to play around with it. See how your sheet comes out. If it comes out wrong, you try this over again until the way you get it. That's the best way to learn it and the location basic left and we're just going to go ahead with this default for now click next the uh, profile style that's fine we're not going to uh, band set is a plan and profile sheet elevation and station that's good now let's create a view frame and there's our view frame right here as you can see and there's our uh, stationing and overlap By 50 feet so now we'll go ahead and create sheet so we're back in here from the same output tab go in here the next uh, uh, icon over says create sheet click that 
and then here we're going to fill out this information and we want to go to the alignment that we selected which was in our case alignment 200 and we want all view frame and really you want to select all layout in the current drawing or you could have other option too uh, layout name that's fine and cd title block that's okay next and the uh, sheet set name that's good we're just going to go with that so there's nothing that we want to change next and then you're going to in here you can choose your setting for your uh, profile but we already have done this so you can go ahead and click this and uh, go through the wizard we did been here before how do you want these uh it will give you uh want to make sure these are, are your label already set complete here so that's good that's all I'm looking for so your label are complete it's not none and next uh, we don't just finish this up anyway okay now we come back to the other window and create sheets okay uh, to complete save your project that's fine and make sure come over here so click right here and we'll generate the uh, um, profiles. Uh, it didn't come out good because it, it went too quick. So let's type in a region and kind of clean it up a little bit. There you go. Uh, now let's go ahead and uh, see our, what our sheet set came out to. We made some changes. Let's grab this here. Yeah, you see, there's your sheets. There they are. 